guys and welcome back to my channel. To myself. What a wonderful So today's video is another weekly vlog. It's currently Wednesday, February 9th. And I did a little haul during lunch um, today and I went to Ross and I went to the Dollar Tree. I was actually looking for some bins to organize our pantry because it's a mess, but I didn't find any bins, but I did find some other stuff. So I'll go ahead and flip the camera around and show you what I got. So up first was Dollar Tree and I did pick up a few things for Valentine's Day. Ryan, don't look at this, okay. Um, I picked up a three pack of bags, super cute. $1.50 store now, not dollar. Um, some tissue paper, a little uh, card together we just fit, it's so cute. I love you to pieces, happy Valentine's Day. And I did get him um, some magnets for the fridge with our faces on it and it's really cute. So those are coming in the mail. Um, I did get some things for the kitchen. This is from Ross, not that. I got just like a Brillo pad uh, sponge. I got some more sponges and then we need some like copper ones cause we do have a cast iron. So got that, we'll see how that works. And then I kind of stocked the pantry on um, spices cause we don't have any. We have a few, but not a lot. Um, so I got some cayenne, some paprika, some Italian seasoning, some thyme leaves, um, some garlic salt. We have garlic powder and onion powder already. And then I got some ranch just in case. You never know when you're gonna need emergency ranch. So that's everything from the Dollar Tree. I was hoping to find some bins for the pantry there, but I didn't see any while I was there. So we went to Ross and I got stuff that I didn't need, but you know. I got this beautiful like recipe book holder. It's marble on the bottom and wood on the top. And it was $7.99, oh, $9.99. So honestly, not a bad price. Honestly, not a bad price. Really good price for this marble. So it's really cute. And it's gonna go, actually like, I'll show you. It's gonna go right here for our avatar cooking book, but super cute right there. And then I did pick up this wax warmer. It looks like this. This is the exact same brand that I bought off of Amazon, which is the one plugged into my kitchen right now. So I figure I'll use this in like a bathroom, I think. This was $5.99. So it matches the other one exactly. It's really cute. So really happy that I found this one. I think on Amazon, it was like $10. So $6, pretty good deal. And then I did pick up some hand soap, Method Pink Grapefruit, because we actually don't have any hand soap at the kitchen right now. Or yeah, we do. Just kidding. We have Mrs. Myers, but I'll just keep this one underneath the sink for extras. Okay. So the next thing that I got, and actually the last thing is this two pack. Well, it wasn't really a pack of two. I just got two of them of these like kitchen organizer basket things. They're $2.99 and I figured we could put them in our pantry, which let's try it on this one. <gasps> yes, see, that's so nice. And then we could put like the bread in there, free up some space. I love that. So I'm gonna work with those uh, and try and clean up the pantry a bit, but I knew, do need some like baskets like these. I need some baskets for the pantry, but that'll do for now. So yeah, just a random home haul. Um, we did, I did get like a little shelf to go downstairs to put our keys on when we walk in the door, uh, but we gotta hang that up soon. I have like a few shelving things that I brought from my old uh, bedroom to hang up. So we need to hang those up, but I'll update you guys when we do that. But uh, no big plans for the rest of the week. I have a Galentine's dinner with my cousins on Saturday and then, um, one of our friends birthday parties Saturday night. So that should be fun, but that's about it for, for now. <laughs> and I will see you guys later. Hello guys. It is now Friday, February 11th. It is just after work and I got in a Sephora package. So very excited about that. I'll go ahead and show you guys what I got, but the plans for today are, I think I'm just going to nap right now because I'm super exhausted this week at work was like insane so need a little bit of a break probably gonna have to work this weekend because it was I didn't get anything done this week because it was all derailed but that's okay we're not talking about work right now because I'm off <laughs> so I'm gonna get started with the um Savoro haul but let's bring it <gasps> we have someone joining us hey you hey you hey you
do you have anything you want to say? What do you want to say to the group? Do you stretch? Nothing you want to say? No? Oh? That was cute. Okay, anyways. So the first thing that I did pick up is a super goop sunscreen because I am out of mine. I have the play sunscreen right now and I'm running out. And I wanted to pick up a matte sunscreen, which I've been looking at a few. I decided to go with Super Goop again because it has, um, it's supposed to be reef, reef safe. I actually haven't done my research on it, but the other one I got, I think is reef safe, but it's matte. And I've really been looking for a matte sunscreen because usually the one that I use now just makes my face look oily after I use it, which was great when I had dry skin, but now I have oily skin because it just changed. So yeah, going to try this out. I'll let you guys know how it goes. I believe it was like 30 or $35. Um, I picked up a new Living Proof Scalp Care Dry Scalp Treatment because mine is almost finished. I love this stuff. It is my, like, godsend for my scalp. So really, really good. And then I did pick up this Glow Recipe product, which I've never tried anything from them before. It's the Watermelon Glow PHA and BHA Pore Tight Toner. It's supposed to be hydrating and pore refining. It's supposed to minimize the size of your pores. Kind of excited about that. I've really just been looking for a toner I can use in the mornings and also just, like, every day because currently I only have like a salicylic acid one for acne and I don't want to use that every single day I just want to use it like every other day so I figured I'd get this one and try and use it every day um so that's everything I picked up and then I did get two samples so I got a rare beauty primer sample the pore diffusing the illuminating and the eye primer and then RMS beauty I got this like little what is this? Master Radiance Base. I think it's a tinted primer, radiant primer. So pretty cool. But yeah, I just did like a Sephora order and wanted to update you guys. But yeah, no big plans for today. For this weekend, I do have a Galentine's um, lunch tomorrow. So I'm going to be going um, do that during lunch. And then we have one of our friend's birthday parties that afternoon so that should be fun that's like the only real plans we have for saturday and sunday is super bowl sunday so we actually need to like get a plan we don't have cable so we need to get like i think we're just going to expand the disney plus plan that ryan has now and get hulu and espn plus um and try to watch the super bowl that way and order pizza and wings and just chill at the house <laughs> so that should be fun um I just really enjoy watching the Super Bowl for the commercials. So I'll probably talk about the commercials at the end of the vlog. If you guys are also like ones who love watching Super Bowl, watching the Super Bowl just for the commercials. So that's fun. But yeah, that's like pretty much it for the updates for now. Um, if you've noticed, I have not been responding to comments lately. I'm so sorry. I apologize. First, it was because I was moving and I had no time to reply to comments. And then this week has been like insanity at work. So I also have not had time to reply to comments, but I'm still posting. So that's good. But I need to, I need to go and answer everybody's comments at some point this weekend. I will be doing that. But yeah, that's everything for the update for now. I'm going to change into my PJs and go take a nap. <laughs> so I will see you guys later.
gonna be all right. Oh my God. Hello guys, it is now actually already Monday, February 14th, happy Valentine's Day. And I'm gonna upload this video today, but I forgot to sign up last night after the Super Bowl. I was really sad that the Bengals lost, um, mainly because I wanted Joe Burrow to win, <laughs> but that's okay because we still had Odell on the Rams side and the Rams won, but it kind of got a little bit boring near the end. I really didn't see any cool um, commercials and yeah, the halftime show though, that was really good. I feel like they kept it like simple as far as there was like no like crazy theatrics, but they didn't really need to because all the artists were amazing and all their songs were amazing and everybody knows the lyrics and it was just a fun time. I feel like that was a really good show. So yep, that was everything for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.